Good morning, I'm Trish Pahanik, and this is Synopsis, your first early morning briefing. Today is Wednesday, March 3rd, 2010. Here are today's top stories. NBC 17-night coverage of the 2010 Vancouver Winter Olympic Games averaged 24.4 million total viewers, representing an increase of plus 21% compared to the 06 Winter Games in Turin. Sunday's closing ceremony also attracted 21.4 million viewers. Cablevision Systems Corporation released a statement yesterday in response to the threat by ABC Disney. Charles Schuler, EVP of Communications with Cablevision, said, quote, We pay more than $200 million a year to ABC Disney for their programming, and now they say they will pull the plug unless Cablevision pays $40 million more in new fees for the exact same channels. It's not fair to force Cablevision customers to pay a new TV tax for programming ABC Disney gives away free, both over the air and on the Internet. Stars Entertainment acquired the U.S. television rights to the Pillars of the Earth. The series stars Ian McShane, Rufus Sewell, Matthew McFadden, and Donald Sutherland. Stars will air the miniseries this summer. HBO tapped Oscar-winning actor Dustin Hoffman to headline its new drama pilot, Luck, set in the world of horse racing and gambling. Hoffman will play a smart, tough guy who has always been a gambler and after being released from prison. This project marks Hoffman's first television series role. And additionally at HBO, they're moving forward with the fantasy series Game of Thrones. The project is based on the novels by George R. R. Martin about the mythical land of Westeros and the upstanding Stark family. ABC assigned Julie Benz to star as Michael Chiklis' wife in a new drama, No Ordinary Family, per THR. Benz will play a scientist to Chiklis, artist turned police sketch artist. Sci-Fi begins production on the sophomore season of Warehouse 13 this month in Toronto and has set the second season premiere date for July 13th. Comedy Central approved a new 10-episode, 30-minute weekly scripted series titled Workaholics. The project stems from a fifth-year in mail-order comedy webisode about three friends just out of college who live and work together as telemarketers. Jason George landed a role on ABC's new medical drama pilot Off the Map, cites THR. Now the plot is about three doctors who leave the U.S. to work in an isolated clinic in the tropics. George will play a dazzling ER doctor at the clinic who likes to chase girls, smoke cigarettes, and play dirty jokes. on that note, that's a wrap. Be sure to check your email for the full printed version of today's synopsis with new executive moves and more on ratings, some new classified ads, a few other bits and pieces that did not make it into this podcast, and be sure to check out tonight's primetime broadcast lineup. This is a Synopsis Media production in association with 311 West. For Cynthia Turner, who wrote and compiled Synopsis in Connecticut, I'm Trish Pahonik. I'm gonna have a good day. If I make it myself, I'm gonna have a good day. I don't need no one else. I'm gonna have a good day. Nothing wrong I could do. I'm gonna have a good day. Hope you have a good day too.